Twenty one, 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 twenty one. Episode twenty one. Oh, you guys had comments, right? You want to read through? Hell yeah! I haven't seen any yet, so it's going to be interesting. All right, we're never ready for this. No, um, but we had way. we had quite a few about you, Rob. Why? Yeah, How all long? the top ones are always Rob. Oh gosh, Roberto. I did not pull up the right thing, but Rob Vamp. While we, so I up. got no, I got two. I'll okay. just start off the bat. Number one, <laughs> last week. Wait, are, is it, does this count as our? Okay, yeah, we, yeah, we're in. We're in. Our, okay. yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. We've been Anton Halden said Rob has the same outfit as his water bottle, and I appreciate it. <laughs> what was I wearing last week? That red. I don't shirt. remember. Yeah. <laughs> you're wearing your oh, work shirt. Oh, I was wearing my red work shirt. Yeah, yeah. And, and the other gray hat is uh kills for you <laughs> quick complaint vg please turn on night mode for your youtube i can see your phone from wisconsin <laughs> <laughs> i actually can't turn that off it's not a, it's not an option on the what's yeah, it called it is. on no. an iphone dude just get an is iphone because there's a dark mode nope. for the but this, this this poor guy lives in wisconsin, well, I can see your phone <laughs> wisconsin. so this is like the dashboard app so it doesn't have a night mode for Oof. it the actual uh, youtube app does but the dashboard does not i have poor a guy, youtuber though. guys that sucks. My favorite is literally no one. Rob, grannies are so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> I say that. Yeah, <laughs> probably. It's because uh, I was talking about your job or whatever, and you just leaned it. I was like scamming grannies, and you're like, oh, grannies yeah, are so that sexy. Makes sense. Uh, <laughs> my, that water bottle one's killing me because it's the gray lid and the red. Thing. Also, I don't give a shit if you can see my hair sticking up. I like it like that. Is it what a comment? No, a comment. Yeah, there's like, like, I can't hey. stop looking at Drew's hair in the it back doesn't sticking even stick up. up that much. Okay, so. This There's one chilling. comment that Drew brought to my attention, Rob. I want to know if you have any idea what this means because it sounds like something you'd say. Okay. It says Drew's shirt having look, look uh, Drew's shirt having him look like a schmule. Sorry, Drew, nothing personal. Shme- what? I've never heard that word before. So, from my best googling abilities, it's the little kid from the boy in striped pajamas. Oh, that is what it is. Actually, <laughs> I remember watching that sh- that in class. It's a depressing ass movie to show a bunch of like fifteen year olds, but right? Yeah. I don't that, even that's know what that is. Me either. The boy. It's a gym. movie. It's a movie about like it's like a historical movie about like a boy who is the son of like a, a high ass Nazi of like, person. Yeah, like yeah. a German Fuck. a German lieutenant, and then they live right beside a concentration camp. So the boy like out playing finds a concentration camp and he makes friends with the boy in striped pajamas, mean, which is like uh, a captured. Uh, what do you mean he Talk finds it? it? Like they're, they're just, just like, like they're like he's out playing and then he just looks at it like this fence and he sees a kid sitting there watching him. Oh. Yeah, and the so movie has like, like there's no happy ending. It is the so grimmest like, shit I've ever like seen. It's like a Jewish kid that's sitting there in striped their, pajamas like, uniform, but like yeah. the boy, he's innocent. He's like, oh, like my friend, he wears striped pajamas, and they just like go and uh, they oof. hang out on the other side of the. And fence. then he goes into the concentration camp, and then they like he happens to be there when, you know, they take him to the the chambers, the chambers, oof, and geez. then so the guy kills his own kid. Spoiler yeah. alert for anyone who hasn't seen the movie or was going to watch it, but it's pretty messed well, up. Yeah. Ten a, out of ten still would watch. It's very, very uh, moving. On a equally depressing note, <laughs> someone in the comments said, "We need to counter on how many times Rob says you know what I mean." You, you know, know what I mean? mean. I do say that a lot. <laughs> you do. <laughs> oh, Rob, you're not showing off the haircut. Oh, I guess oh I could. Rob, fresh it's cut. Like, it yeah, literally trim. looks the same. It's more of a trim. It's like you, you all got this the, got you got the back. wings chopped up. You still need to, you need to get rid of the wings. Dude, this I don't want this to happen. Everyone always asks about but it's it. It's because it's too long. No, it's definitely just how his hair goes. Like, though. It's because my hat too. It like, presses it on my ear. It's mostly just yeah, your if though. your hair was shorter, like my well, yeah, hair, like, it, there, it wouldn't wing out. If this wasn't here, it wouldn't do that. But like as soon he, as it gets like like even the smallest amount, it just pops over. You would need to go like fade level for it to not wing out though. I'm not. I bet people would, have different types of hair, though. Yeah, but yeah. his hair is also like three times or twice as long as mine. Yeah, yeah. Twice. that boy's hair's thick too. It's thick, bro. I use he head got shoulders. that tick tick hair. Rob, head going sh- in the beard, I see. Yeah, a little bit. I had to man, shave the bottom right. half though because my neck pubes are just getting yeah, fucking the gross. Getting in there. <laughs> like Fair. literally, like pubic hair. Like you know how it's like stringy. That was on yeah, my neck. Yeah. All like curly. Yeah. Oh. Doesn't come in straight at yeah. all. So I had to get rid of that. But yeah. it's just like the pedo stash. Oh, so this isn't going anywhere anytime soon. It this really is... bothers me that you have the reverse Hitler. I know we've mentioned this I know, before. Right here. But... It really bothers me that it just hasn't grown any longer. In I know. The... It just, I haven't touched it in so long. Exactly. It just stays right here. <laughs> but doesn't change. I, mean, I, haven't, I haven't shaved in like two months, maybe? Two months? Well, no, I was going to say, what the fuck? <laughs> this guy. Be Normally I lie. shave on Mondays. Just That's the only day I shave. I'm like, I don't want to look like Jeez. shit for the podcast. Yeah. But today I forgot. Yeah, he doesn't like care about you guys. I, I always look like shit because we just go climbing after. Yeah, I'm not gonna get dressed up. I'm going climbing. Yeah. What going. kind of asshole would show up to the podcast in a dress shirt yeah. and a fancy watch? What kind of schmuel? 
<laughs> Some schmuel looking dude. You finally got a phone case, Drew. Yeah, Drew. man. I got the got the Spigen phone case. Yeah. With them. You've had it like us. two weeks. Not this one. This I one's s- this one's been a week. And then they, they went on sale like two days after I bought it. And I'm like, yo, can I have the sale price? And they're like, normally no, but sure. Why not? Like, right? Cool. Where was this? Online. Bought it online. <laughs> Drew probably literally, you know that one time he dropped his phone in his old case? He's probably like, this case might not be good Dude, He didn't even have <laughs> a case the one. first time he dropped it. The other one was like an otter box and it was just like so thick. Yeah. That it was just like the aggressively defender. thick. Like this one's fine. Yeah, because you're not you're not Our going on any like work sites anytime soon. What the, is yeah. it like a button? No, it's my it's fingerprint, fingerprint scanner. scanner. Oh, that's a fingerprint scanner. Yeah, yeah, bro. What the fuck? Welcome to Android. I want Master them to race. Race. Yeah. create like the Apple logo. Turn that into a fingerprint scanner. Yeah. Well, the Apple like but iPhone. They just use face that'd be sick. You though. can unlock with your that face. That wouldn't work yeah. though because it's an Apple. <laughs> How would your finger fit on the apple? I don't know. It doesn't have to be perfect. You just Man. put this little circle in the apple. I just got a CBC true. news notification warning people not to travel to Wuhan. Like, wow. Oh, damn. Oh, I, gotta, I, I gotta cancel my plans. <laughs> I was for booking my day. vacation tomorrow. Yeah. Well, it's because of uh, Chinese New Year, right? Yeah, but yeah. like, why would you like... Because for them, it's like a really big deal. But you can't... But I like, they shut down transportation. You can't get in or out. Miss one Chinese New Year, die, miss them all. Get the coronavirus. You know, True. there's a lot of people with like traditions and customs that they would literally be willing to die for. Yeah, That's like just like ah, don't, the don't kill everyone else you, with you. I can guarantee. You I get that every summer. That if the Vikings <laughs> ever made it to the Super Bowl <laughs> and they said, "If you come to this game, like you will literally die. Like there is a bomb planted in I'm the stadium way. and it's gonna blow up." You, Rob would be there. I'd die, but we there. look he for those type of YouTube. excuses. Honestly. I would. I would die. Ha- I would die happy. Exactly. I'd, like, I'd guarantee exactly. myself a happy, quick death. Well, imagine oh, the bomb no. goes off after uh, the Vikings. Christian, get... stop saying the B word. The bomb. The, the Vikings are down oh, like thirty-five no. to zero in the first quarter. I just say hurry up. Just, just <laughs> yeah. it now. Remember that time here. we were monetized for a week? Almost. Mm. Oof. Wait, if you're saying... We're monetized. We are. Yeah. Yay. 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 We're rolling in that five dollar per month. Uh. Yeah. Where's our mm. paychecks? Any kind of direct deposit? <laughs> you a loony. <laughs> exactly. Like hey, I'll take it. Invest it. Rob Watch needs it grow. <laughs> uh, bank account update. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I got a really nice paycheck nice the other day from check. work. Yeah, because like all those grannies. It, exactly. The commission <laughs> comes in at the end of the. It's oh, weird. that c word. Yeah. So it, so like you, it comes in the end of the month after. So say like so I. So it's a month. I'm late. just sitting here spitballing here. So it's a month late. Yeah. So yeah, I yeah, yeah. I got December's <laughs> commission check at the end of January. <laughs> So my bank account right now, it's looking pretty juice. That's sweet. Should I even put the real number out there? Or is that nah, really like- I, you're probably getting to the point where you don't need to. I can't. It's going to be like five years from now. And Rob's going to be like a multimillionaire. He's like, nah. here's my bank account update. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll put it this way. The first two, Wait. We're back, in the, <laughs> we're back in the one comma club. Hey, okay. And the Does first two digits. Two? No, almost. One seven. Oh, oh wow, yeah, wow. I wonder how much money you get. One Ooh. seven. <laughs> well, I'm even the last no, four digits awesome. up in it's the. It's seventeen ninety nine. Yeah, seventeen. Did you see the last 38? four digits? I There's, guess the cents, but who the yeah, fuck's the gonna sense. be like? Oh, you have seventeen ninety and twenty one cents. Yeah, you never know. Man, when Someone you when you've been counting me. pennies for a while, it's uh, it's man. a hard habit to shake. I throw back to the days where I was like, do I want to get Subway or do I want to be able to drive my car? Because gas versus subway. Now he does I mean? both. Now I'm just like, fuck hey. it, dude. I'll buy gas on the way to subway. Bourbon subway. Street every day, <laughs> oh, baby. I've eaten bourbon every... No. four. I've had four meals from bourbon in the last eight days. <laughs> Damn. That that's, was you. That's like, that's that's like, like guard days. center numbers. Oh, uh, yeah. I was eating it five times a week. I, I remember one time... When I was in Toronto doing my co-op, I found out they had a bourbon street grow in like the Eaton Center. So like, mm-hmm. oh, fuck, I'm going to go get it. It's so good. And then out, on my way there, I was like, oh, look up the reviews to see how it is. Every single review was like one star, one star. I found a cockroach in my Chinese. So I was like, yeah. oh, no, I'm maybe going I'll back pass. Home. Wouldn't be me. I love that fucking place, man. Yeah, bourbon's so good. <laughs> I, I don't know. think I've ever had it. You've never had bourbon? No, I'm a picky eater. Again, I, I, bitch, I lived <laughs> off that. saving me from the Rona season. Dude, it's like, it, it just, <laughs> Rona season. Uh, what? It, that's that? Corona oh, season. The... Like, the, like you say, oh, the coronavirus. It's, oh, I get that every summer. You know what I mean? <laughs> get it yeah I, I get it but it's like I'm not you i don't have jokes go over my head no oh, yeah yeah but uh <laughs> bourbon it like, it like fills you up because it's like you get a thick amount of pasta yeah the chicken is so thick Dumb and, and, and then you, you get, get like a veg too yeah i like guess a greasy ass vegetable but you still you still feel healthy the best it. is uh wait what's your go-to combo so i go chicken or combo one chicken noodles yeah and but like beans. what do you get 
Be- oh, beans. chicken noodle beans, or if they don't have the beans, they'll go broccoli. I go. I but what go, chicken? Like the bourbon chicken oh, okay. or bourbon bourbon. I get the two vegetable bourbon. You get two vegetables. Yeah. Oh. So I go. I go like the pasta, and then I go um, the mashed potatoes with the red gravy. Oh yeah, because that's, that's so fucking. The gravy red, should not be red. Yeah. It's that, a mystery gravy. I think, it's, I, think it's bur- I think it's just the chicken sauce. I, I don't know. Specifically it's because it's not supposed to be yeah, that yeah. way. And then I get the big like home fried potatoes. All the home fries. Are so, and you dip them in the chicken sauce. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dude, and then I, get oh, the, I keep talking about this, man. I don't even know. I think it's just whatever the whitest chicken is, honestly. Yeah, the bourbon's probably. Or the honey garlic stuff. No, it's definitely honey garlic. Yeah. I, I think they changed the one I get to a different name. But it used to be called like the Chin Chang Chicken. Yeah, no chicken. I actually thought I'd probably pronounce being racist, it, man. And I would say racist. it, and they'd always like look at me like, "Whoa!" No, they're just no. being, they're just know being, how. And they racist. fucking changed the name. I think it's like sweet and sour chicken now. Like, <laughs> they put it. it to his actual name. <laughs> this guy called it Ching Chong Chicken. What a guy, man! <laughs> That's what it was called. Oh, <laughs> no, it was actually something like. That. Yeah, it was. It was actually that. Because I, I had one sure, of the people sure. be like, "Oh, yeah, like, yeah, do you yeah. know how to speak a Mandarin? I guess whatever." Oh, can see Cantonese. Yeah, Mandarin. Yeah. How old are you? Even people who speak Mandarin Rob, what do they speak, speak in Japan? Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember what you said? Uh, sort of. You said, I'm pretty sure you said Chinese. But they speak in Japan. <laughs> I kind of black out sometimes. And then it's like, dude, you can't believe you said that. And I'm like, oh, I did say that. <laughs> oh, Rob watches his back. Oh, all oh right. yeah. All right. I have that. I'm okay. really liking this Rob character. <laughs> <laughs> that story I told you about the old man porn at oh, work. It, yeah, okay, I was in class. So, um,. This is so fucking hilarious. It was the strangest thing ever. So like probably two weeks ago, okay. uh, Niall puts like our work group chat. He's like, hey, do you guys never going to believe what happened? I came into work there that day. And it turns out some old guy came in because like, he kept getting an alarm on his phone. Okay. And it would pop up. And it was one of those like, you know, like porn things. And it was like looking for fucking. And that's all I said <laughs> over and over again. And this guy's like, I can't get it off my phone. And then Niall's like, I'm not touching it. So they take it out of here, right? Anyway, so yesterday, Wait, what? Why, why would he not touch it? I, he, like, what is he? Well, get like the coronavirus. I, well, I know it's like, he, like, the, Whoa, like they they were saying like his phone's quite covered in jizz, right? That's yeah. just like whatever. Oh, true, true. Um, anyway, so yesterday I'm working true. in so, like I, I personally I, I well I did touch it unknowingly, <laughs> but uh, he licked it. Take yeah, that out of I smelt it and I was like, you know, um, I dealt this. <laughs> <laughs> but. Uh, so I'm working and some old man comes in, <clears throat> pretty nice guy. And he's like, he ends up getting a new phone and he's like, so we're setting it all up. And he's like, Hey, can you do me a favor? And I'm like, yeah, sure. He's like, can you delete my like Safari, like browser history? Cause like my, my stepson, I always find my stepson takes my phone and does a whole bunch of stuff on it. And I'm like, Oh, like, okay, sure. I'm thinking he's maybe like, you know, oh, like no. looking at kind of like just like maybe sketchy websites, like, uh, I don't know, like hacking or something like that. Nothing like too crazy. <laughs> just Google yeah. hacking. Well, like, I don't know. Right. Like you, you don't automatically assume it's going to be like, I would immediately that. assume it would be porn. I don't know. Cause like he seemed like a pretty level headed, normal person. Okay. But like, it'd be like your average old guy being like, Hey, like, can you look at my phone for a second? I was like, yeah, sure. Anyway, so I go into his Safari, and this guy has never closed a tab ever. There's a hundred plus <laughs> tabs of just porn. It's like the first thing I see is like squirting compilation 2019. <laughs> like, oh, oh, 2019. Yeah, right, all this. Back. Like, there's literally like, and I'm saying going like bang, like trying to get rid of all this as fast as I can. Like, <laughs> you're, 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 like Rob's manager comes on him. Is there anything? Is there any <laughs> oh, problem man. here, Rob? <laughs> like, I was like sweating because I was like, this is like the most <laughs> awkward situation I've ever been a Wait, part of. What phone was it? It's like an old iPhone. Like, does it not have an, like a close all tabs no, like, thing? Like, no, like his, like when you're on Safari and you have all those open tabs, like I think they were either incognito tabs or something because I was trying to find like the close all button that like, oh. there's is on most browsers. Interesting. But there's not. So I'm going through <laughs> each individual fucking he, thing. I, he strategically played that Probably. so you would be uncomfortable. And dude, longer. I can just like going through and there's just so many vile pictures on the thing. That's this amazing. customer is walking around. <laughs> I don't and don't then think he's it like close all. He does it. Well, yeah, because that would have been really helpful Man. if it did. Mm. iOS, huh? Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. And the new iOS Android's update better. keeps freezing new phones too, which is a pain Whoa. in the ass. But Apple. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'm just going through it. And he's like, thank you so much, man. He's like, my wife the other day had my phone and she was like, what are you watching? Man? <laughs> and then I, he was like, he told me how to blame his stepson. This poor stepson, like, this poor guy just getting framed for watching like fucking hours and hours of porn. That's amazing. <laughs> just, oh, on, his, on his dad's stepdad's phone too. Like, what the fuck? Oh, and then fuck. I'm like setting up his new phone. And then I'm like, 
hey, just so you know, on this new phone, I'm like, you can actually search, like, use the internet, like, in, like, a secret mode. And I showed him how to use, like, uh, hey. incognito mode. And he's like, oh, thanks. I'll be, sure to, I'll be sure to let him know just in case he ever borrows it again. And I'm like, you're a real just one. get the fuck out of my store. <laughs> this is so gross. And then he comes back like an hour later being like, I don't know how to turn my volume up or down. Because, like, on, an, on the new... jerk in the, the bathroom. I don't know, man. And then like, it's and then on full blast. <laughs> no, it's on full uh, blast. He's trying to turn it down. But like, uh, he kept oh. like when you try to when you press the volume button and the lock button on the new iPhone, it takes a screenshot. So he's been doing that over and over and over. Again. And so there's I check, like so many shirts. I know, like, no, I check his I check his photo gallery and there's like literally like twelve screenshots of his home screen because he's been trying to change the volume this whole time. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's like. A- it's on super, super quiet, and you just hear in the stall beside him, it's Donald. Turn it up. <laughs> Donald's like, quick, man. Yo. <laughs> so pass it under. I think Donald lives by my work. I've come I've come out of my office like three times now, and Donald's just sitting outside. Really? Is he homeless? I don't know. No, have I, we told Donald stories before in the podcast? Nah. He's the best guy I've ever... We might have actually earned uh, He's a former maybe. co-worker. Mm-hmm. He's yeah. a former co-worker who's like... How do you describe it? But like... Without sounding he's like not all together there yeah, yeah. question mark i don't know how he's like uh he's older he's like probably I'd say what like 40 something by now i'd guess yeah 50s I'd low 50s 50. late um, 40s and we like how do we say this without sounding terrible i think you already did yeah. you're good yeah, yeah. Honestly, honestly, some of my say. favorite shifts were with jeremy and donald and just seeing oh. them go at it yeah they would just chirp the entire time <laughs> yeah, so jeremy was another co-worker of ours who was like perma fried yeah that's what you put it right yeah. like he did so much fucking shit but like not good he yeah. was, he no, was like, stuck in the 70s oh yeah, yeah. i really want to like i really want to learn like brain his whole story you know what I mean? yeah. like no one knows like anything about no. him before zares except for his one buddy who would come in with the short guy with the huge oh, beard yeah, he buddy. looks like Gimli. with the with the flyer shirt yeah literally they would just he would they would just talk shit about like heavy metal and stuff for like <laughs> a couple hours mm-hmm. and then uh, but i have him on xbox and he's just always playing the most random shit too <laughs> he's playing like um you have him on xbox yeah out of them like Jeremy? six years ago yeah my little pony three <laughs> <laughs> playing that for the wrong reasons <laughs> but no he's always playing like weird indie games or like borderlands he fiends borderlands like he's like whenever like it's an indie game no like i'm saying in addition <laughs> my to favorite indie, indie game <laughs> yeah like, like he is on whenever i'm on and i'm on quite a bit like i'll get off at like 3 30 some days he's still going strong on something that's jokes and then i'll hop on at like 9 a.m one day if i'm just invite happened, him yeah so you just i always like one time i did by accident because like you just you go like i go to my friends list and just press a button to invite people mm-hmm. and one time i invited him that had to quickly disband what i was doing <laughs> and it, and i was like oh. i do that all the time when i'm trying to invite drew and then like i invite him he doesn't accept it so then i go to invite again and as i go to click his name like he had accepted the previous invite <laughs> so his name disappears and it shifts one up i'm just inviting yeah, random actually. people from my friends i'm like no 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 that's yeah. like Shane always randomly invites Andy to our yeah, I was going to say in Smite because Andy always comes up to, on top. So yeah. I'm used to just popping on, click all the names, invite. And if he's on top, you just automatically click. And then like, what, a month ago, we had like a random two games with them. Yeah. And he's like, hey, uh, join this Discord. Oh, shit, gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> We're like, oh, no, man, we were going to go climbing a half hour ago, so yeah. we're going to go do that now ago. instead. <laughs> well, speaking of which, next week, Rob will be joining us for yes. climbing. we got to make yeah. it official on here so you to... can't back out. He's not yeah. backing out. It's locked I, in. I, I, had already, I had already locked Although myself you had, in. You yeah. thought you were coming today. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was today. <laughs> I think we also have to make official podcast bets on how he's going to do. Ooh. That's a good call. Speaking actually. of bets, I need to say something after, but I, I, think, I, don't think, I don't think you'll get above a V2. I think guaranteed V3. I, I think Rob gets And I'm going to cherry pick one hard for him so yeah. he can do an easy one. Okay. So Rob said that he wanted to make a bet with me. Okay. He said that he was willing to bet that he could do a bet or a harder climb than me. So it's not possible. What? Because that blue one that Christian, he can do one now. That's actually pretty hard. Mm-hmm. He can't do any others, just one. So okay. one, one V4, yeah. which is like halfway up the scale in difficulty. What's the and hardest? V well, oh, it's like V uh, No, there's V8 a V10. Plus. They yeah. just stopped counting after V8. Oh. But, and they're nuts. But anyways, Rob, I said, I'm willing to bet $5 that you can't. He said, I'm not about that pussy shit. $500. And I was like, that's not smart. But he with the 17. All right, 100 no, 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 do like I five do, bucks. I'm not doing three digits. That's fucking drop wild. back to ninety nine point nine nine. I'm trying to like look for something in this room just to describe to Rob like what a V8 would look like. Like this on a V8 is a great hold. Like if you were just holding onto that. No, I don't, I don't understand. Like holding the whole phone. This would be on this the wall. Was on the wall. 
That's like a fantastic hold for a V8. So like the rocks are just like almost flush. With yeah, the, yeah, yeah. You're like palming like rocks. You're like basically trying, palming like, like the, flat the, rectangles. The chance of any of us doing a V8 at this table is like like negative. So is that what determines the difficulty is how bumped no. out the rocks well, are? Well, it's, it's the rocks. Like that's one There's factor so many in it. Things. There's also like how far apart they are. The angle what, of the wall. The, what uh, like, mechanics they have. Like some of them are like dinos, which is where you like hold on to one or two rocks and you have to throw yourself up and then Which, grab oh, I have gotten so I, I hope that yellow one's still there because I have a nasty one I've been doing consistent now it's sick and there yeah. was one that I, like the one one gym that we go to where you start on like say like one wall over here and you have to throw yourself to the other wall which is about this far apart what the fuck? and the okay. one that you have to hold on to is literally like a sp- a pyramid yeah. aiming right so, at your so then, face. So, so if you impale yourself on there, but, you're... But then you have to like catch that. Shit. You have to catch that. And as your feet swing, you have to hook your feet on a rock underneath. It's like literally parkour almost. Yeah, man. basically. Yeah. But like, so for instance, you can have a V3 with like massive boulders. And then you can have a V3 that literally is just like little crimps like this that you're just like climbing up. But See, they're like the same Do they cycle the walls out all the time? So or assume, what? Yeah, I assume we're going to new, right? I think that's probably the mm-hmm. best. So with new... Rob. Yeah, so that, new yeah. they they rate it two threes and then four fives. So okay, it's so you gonna can't be hard to really tell. tell. Yeah, like there's walls there that I'm like I don't know whether. It's but I'm two very. Or three. And I'm, they also I, they definitely make it harder there because we've done V twos V threes. I'm like that would be a V four at the other gym. Kind of, but I I can guarantee you'll do two threes if I you hope get so. one pink at the new gym. I'd be like a V four or five. I'd be crazy impressed. But I'm I'm sure I can we can cherry pick one. I'm not going to go to the gym that day just so I can have maximum strength. That's yeah. smart. Yeah. I think the big issue for Rob, though, will be like balance and technique, which will just yeah, not I, be. I had my tech, I'll be honest. I'm a little freaked out just because did, you got like, you got injured. You hurt yourself at rock climbing, too, or is that that's something just, else? That's from doing like fucking stupid shit. Heel hooks. Okay, so there's this technique that you can do that's called a heel hook where you bring your foot up and you basically just I can, like... I can you, you, hook your heel, heel yeah, hook. Yeah. you anchor your heel in. So Drew would do this for the easiest fucking walls. It'd literally be a ladder, and he'd heel hook up and be like, oh, <laughs> yeah, this makes sauce. it so much easier. He just overused it. And yeah, we'd yeah. be Too like, early. you don't need to do that. You I, literally just, like, there's another hold right next to it. You just put your foot on there. He's but like, no, to be off. fair to Drew, I, I'm honestly, glad he, he taught me because now I need them. There's somewhere I, think, I need honestly, to do honestly, what it. got me is just jumping repeatedly from the top. That will also do it. Like, did you, was it just like- Just land a, better. Was this on an injury yeah. that happened like, like, like at once? Or it's like, a, it just, it just started to get sore. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, fair. Okay, but you just straight up fell. How'd that happen? Out of the top of the Literally, wall. Literally, he's, he's at the like, top of the wall, like, <laughs> pretty much parallel, trying to match his hands on the last hold. And as he got the hands there, so his feet are pretty much level with his hands. The His hands slipped off. And then he, like, over-adjusted, so he swung and then kind of swung too far, and everything on the one ankle. Dude, aren't you being, like, held up by people? No. no bouldering is Ooh. where you have no... Rep- there's no repel. Yeah. yeah. No. Oh. You just have, like, you just have thick mats below you. Yeah. How thick? Like, like 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 dummy thick like, one and a half to two feet but we're going to the new gym so they're not as worked in well, yet. they're they're thick they're just a little no stiffer. they're not even meant to be worked in no they're meant to so to like get off the walls you just like you down climb you down yeah. climb. oh and you so climb then, like halfway down and then hop. and you can use any rocks when you go down so you just like hold on to whatever and you at the okay. new gym they have specific rocks for down climbing mm-hmm. it'll okay. be you'll see it'll be i'm just trying to picture in my head right now what four we could get him to do that christian could I don't at think the there's a gym? single four at the new gym that you could do. We're going to do that red one, the balance one I do. There's no ah, way. Not a chance. <laughs> yeah, there's ones where you have to basically like be on your tippy toes. Your like, chest is up against the wall. Your nose is like, this close to the wall. And, and if you, you can't... peel off an, a centimeter, you just fall. Mm-hmm. Maybe oh, fuck, like that man. orange or that yellow one at the back. The uh, problem is just no. starting it. No, because you gotta. It's all bad. You gotta stand up without holding anything. What are the odds I get injured True. out of ten? Like, like four? none. None. The no. only thing that you might you well no, because your hands are all like calloused up, right? Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, you'll They're be kind fine. Of right now. Do you have like calluses in this bit the, of your hands? No, the yeah. top eh. right here and here. Yeah, you're fine. Honestly, like again, they're kind of, you can't really see them because their hands they're still clammy from the gym. But yeah, no, you'll be fine. I don't know. Um, I think I your biggest so. issue is going to be like trying to just hold your body weight with your forearms. And see, the thing is, is you've worked out enough, you've done sports enough, you know when you're pushing it too yeah, hard. I'll be able to sense if I'm like straining myself. Correct. But like, I can do like, I don't know, 50 pull-ups. And like, yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah, like, honestly, I don't think you'll get, you have a less of chance, you have less of a chance getting hurt than probably these two at this point right now. Actually, definitely you. I yeah. made a glass though, man. Like I've I've sprained both wrists. <laughs> yeah, yeah how you doing? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say Drew too. I guess we'll find out, right? Man, also, I'm probably just coming tonight it? too. I'll probably record it. Yeah, we'll I was see. gonna say oh. just the bit, bits of it. 
And in that case, I'll have to wear like something sleeveless, you know, well, just in case. For all the girls, man, yeah. you can take girls. your shirt off there. Is that like viewed as aggressive or is no, it like, viewed as like they want you to? Like, no, no, it's aggressive. You'll, no, you'll, it's aggressive. You'll get chirped if you're doing it for V twos and V threes. Yeah, yeah. 100%. I'm on the, I'm on the baby wall shirt off. But the dudes doing V sevens and yeah. eights, they can they can take their pants off. Oh, you can do it naked. Care. Yeah, okay. exactly. If you're like V six, V seven, like it's completely acceptable just to have your shirt off. Is there Nobody people cares. who just are who just live this shit and like are climbing like fucking Man. Spider-Man? Oh yeah. Dude, oh, yeah. the real Spider Man wear like polos and cargo shorts to climb. Or jeans. Fuck. Or jeans. Or like, yeah, I saw a guy in like a dress shirt shirt yeah climbing dress shirt jeans rock and sevens yeah. like they go work at the bank they come in their suit after work and just climb yeah dude seven. Seems like, what like the all fuck? rich people just do this instead of going to the gym now just rock climbing my hairdresser not many rich people my hairdresser is like <laughs> i was telling her about it because like i don't know how we start talking about it. she's like yeah like me and my like, husband go to the gym or go to the uh, rock climbing instead of going to the gym now we find like, it's much more like invigorating and i'm like yeah i guess for someone who like doesn't really mind like focusing on muscle groups that'd be a better workout that'd mm-hmm. be more entertaining than going to the gym right like mm-hmm. the only thing i see is like climbing would only really work out your back shoulders and like forearms right your core yeah. as well uh, like, yeah. your legs are completely core. neglected though no, yeah no, your no, core your legs so when you I'm, can use a lot so when i'm doing like the dinos and stuff it's all leg strength and also when you're working on a wall that's like this so i'm on the bottom side of this you need like your it's all core you need, okay. you, you you need gotta to like, yourself. You gotta like point your toes and like hook yourself into the wall because like the closer you are to the wall, the better off you're gonna. But, yeah, your center but to be fair, whatever, if you, right? it's your your legs are neglected, and so are like your. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. Technically, yeah. Well, it's like I would never substitute just because like I'm so used to the gym and my routine. But mm-hmm. like it's definitely. I don't it's know, an if alternative. I like it, if I like it, I like it's it. It's a right? difference I, of I, like I, some people don't want to go to the gym and just like stare at a wall lifting weights. Well, they yeah. want to actually like. I like so, it's which like is mental. Fair. That's very fair. Like, even my so, even my mom's same. It's like I'm bored as hell at the gym. And I'm bring like, her Monday. Yeah. The one thing I'll say: every <laughs> single person, play down. <laughs> fucking doing all this crazy shit. Every single person we've brought just gets addicted. Like we brought Brie once. She like literally did one. It's called a VB, and it literally like if you can climb a ladder, you can climb it. It's probably easier. And she's like, I'm hooked. I want to go back. I'm like, and and Brie, okay. her, Brie went a month to come back. Brie went on wow, Monday. Yeah. And um, she was doing like a like a V one, I think, right? V one. Yeah, yeah. And she, it's like when you just, it's not even that hard of a start, but she swung too hard and just blew two calluses. Oh, fuck. And they're flappers, like yeah, they're flappers. And yeah. she, as in the off. skin is just, yeah. She yeah. put some tape on it and kept just, climbing. She kept just, climbing. Just, just yeah. got after it. Yeah. Uh, I, I wouldn't have. I was yeah, like, fuck that. All I'm right, just, you did when you when you had a flapper. That very no, first but we all, we got them at the end. Oh, I did try and do it one, but then the chalk pulls the tape off and it's just like... I have a picture on my old phone from my deadlifted and I had a callus that started here mm-hmm. and I did my deadlift set. This is back when I weighed like 203 pounds. So my was with lifting a lot of weight and I just, my hand started to sting, but I didn't really notice what it was because I just was like adrenaline pumped mm-hmm. and my callus had peeled from here all the way up my face because <laughs> it got caught between my wrist wrap and the bar and just pulled it right off oh. it was like literally a piece of skin like two inches <laughs> long just hanging my hands covered in blood the gym staff comes over to me you all right i'm like yeah i didn't feel it and then you I, skinned I, yourself I, I had a I had a couple nice looking ladies you know tended to my hand right in the middle of a nice arm a and couple like grannies so. <laughs> yeah the like, sexy oh, grannies no. i was like oh it hurts so much please <laughs> kiss it better what's your number <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> i'm gonna die <laughs> What's your number? Tell my mom and you I love her. <laughs> Two thirty though. This is still big Rob. Oh yeah. My heaviest <laughs> ever. I weigh one ninety eight right now. Mm-hmm. So I, this is. They said it was two or no two thirty or two oh three. Two thirty back. Oh, okay. My heaviest ever this was two thirty eight. Casually lost thirty two pounds. Yeah. Well, like I had a like not really rough summer, but like a lot of drinking. Well, I went to Cuba. A lot lost, of drinking. Lost about There's nine pounds in pounds Cuba. There. Yeah. <laughs> came back and then like i looked like i i liked the way i looked because like back when like i weighed 230 about what we're in what we're in january about la- I, a year ago is when i weighed 230 went to cuba in april lost that weight came home liked the way it looked kind of shed some fat a little more veiny nice and uh what do you nice call it lean mm-hmm. so then i was just like fuck i'll just i'll just do this I, and then i got down all the way like 180 and then i was like okay now i feel kind of small 
want to put the weight back on, but then it just it doesn't come back as easy the second time. It's actually time. crazy. 180, you're starting like, I'm 170 yeah. now. Dude, my, my weight fluctuates so much. Like, it's crazy. Like, Mine, most people, like, stay around the same. You've probably been the same weight for, what, like, five years I now? I haven't weighed myself in, like, two years. <laughs> yeah. so I don't Although, I, I put on 20 this year. Yeah, yeah which, which is insane. You guys both look a little bigger, and even you, you have more. Amanda was like, Christian arms. actually looks like he has arm muscles. Yeah. <laughs> I noticed it in your, in your forearms yeah, of all did. places. Because you have that vein coming in on top He's of your He's sitting here just now. flexing the whole time though. <laughs> actually there's one comment about rob flexing there was just like you guys are all talking about random shit and rob's just flexing <laughs> I, did, I, was I was calling this randomly <laughs> i gotta find it sometimes i'm just like fuck you know what i mean but yeah you know what i mean you, you know what i mean you right I mean? yeah uh fuck there was something else i had wanted to talk about but i forget now is check, it in yeah, the list that you saw yeah check there? the thing uh oh chromecast and okay. disney plus yeah um <laughs> Okay, Chromecast is my favorite invention that's ever been yeah, invented sick. in the entire Man, world. I I love it solely for the purpose of watching Leafs games. Wait, you use it for Leafs? How do you like, stream there's, off your there's phone? There's a guy that puts YouTube. Oh, on Reddit, right? Yeah, yeah. He did, but he does YouTube links. So I can watch it on YouTube and then just Chromecast it to whatever TV. Don't your parents have cable, though? <laughs> Like to uh, watch the wait, game. Yeah, you're, yeah. <laughs> you're rich and white. What oh do you mean? my goodness! I lived away at school for. Four uh, okay, years. when you're away, I guess that makes sense. No, but you you still do that now, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, not when I I'm at really home. Never really thought of that. <laughs> yeah. oh, okay. But like when I'm at Bree's no, house, I'll like so roll up the comment. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sidetrack. Yeah. I, I got we the, lost the Leafs them. game just started, so I was checking the score. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> it's literally thirty seconds in. First game back. In like what two weeks now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, is Austin even playing today? Oh, hundred yeah, man, yeah. that that the All Star rest <laughs> that yeah, was yeah, so yeah. fabricated. It was yeah. hilarious. Yeah. Just, they were just he gets like a question mark. He's like, oh yeah, just, you know, I've been nagging at me past couple of weeks. Thought I'd give it a couple. I don't know. Yeah. I wish he just pulled the Ovechkin and just took, said, yeah. I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'm not it. coming. So, and yeah. take the game suspension. Yeah. For for context, <laughs> Christian. If you get invited to the All Star game and you decide not to go, it's an immediate one game suspension. Why? So you get punished and just for not, because, it's like, really stupid. if everyone, it's like your All Star game's the best players in the league. If they all said no, then like no one like, cares. But like exactly. the NHLs are so shit. They're putting it's just pretty much putting on a show for the fans for one yeah. weekend. But like, do they get a choice when they choose them? Can they be like, no, I don't want to. No, they're fine. You have. Well, no, if like, you do, you get a one game suspension. It's yes. like it's it's anti and or anti okay, intuitive so, because so, like the best players are saying we don't want to go, but the league's like fuck. This product is failing, so we have to figure out a way to encourage okay, them so, to so go. Like literally, like every single person in the league said, "Yes, I'm going. Yes, I'm going. Yes, I'm going." And then the only guy who doesn't is Alex Ovechkin, who's like who's the best like, player in the league, one yeah. of or one of for best the last like, ten he's years. Just an NHL icon at this. And point, he just yeah. every single year he's like, "No, I want. I'd rather take this like week as a rest, just go on vacation with the family or something." Yeah. yeah so he just fair. takes the game suspension every year, and his team's like. They should do it in the same sure. way as the NFL does, where it's at the end of the season, because like. But the NFL's Pro Bowl is one of the worst it's, it's also, showings again, in I sports. I just think that kind of event is just it's un awful. unnecessary, because yeah. like it's almost punishing the good players. It's like, the congrats, you made the uh, All Star game. That means when the rest of the league gets two almost two weeks off just to sit around and do nothing, mm -hmm. like recoup and recharge, you're out there busting your ass. Like, see the way the way that but NFL does it. Though? All -stars. See hockey. Yeah. Where, where was it this year? St. Louis. St. Louis. Wait, did they already have it? Yeah, they, they just have Jenna it. Fisher and John Hamm as the coaches. But again, who, <laughs> who wants to go to St. Louis for a week? Yeah. No, Whereas, yeah Jenna and, Fisher. But and the NFL, Only Kansas City fans Jenna that's Fisher? about it. Yeah, like, she was one of the office? coaches. Oh. Yeah. yeah. It was in, pretty funny, actually. I watched a bit of her. In the NFL, life. it's always in Hawaii. Yeah. So, oh, really? And they pay them to go out there. So, like, it's one of those you just bring your family, you have a yeah, good time. It's like a vacation. And mm -hmm. the skills comps in the NFL is actually sick. Yeah. Kirk Cousins lit it up. Yeah, he did. I sent you that video. Where was this? Wait, did they all go? All the Kirk cousins, yeah, yeah all of them go. That's that's impressive. Hey, man, all, that team. all the cousins, <laughs> but it was funny because like they posted that thing, like, and you said like it's like a video of him just like he just throwing so, dimes. So all you gotta do is like thing. quarterback, and then in the distance between like I don't know ten yards and forty yards, there's a bunch of targets worth different values. Quarterback just has to hit the targets, and Kirk Cousins goes out there and he just destroys the field. Puts on a clinic. He hits like the hardest targets first, and then starts taking off all the easy ones. And I messaged Rob like. 
where the fuck was this yeah. all season? I, I, go the, I go to the post and all the comments are like, LOL, where was this this season? And I'm like, because of a Swiss cheese O-line, is too busy picking his helmet up. It's also effort. probably a lot like, easier though to hit a target when you have the time to like, oh, aim oh yeah, yeah, for sure. Especially Cousins, like he had one second to throw yeah. every single time. And if he if he took two seconds, he was literally like picking the turf out of his mask because he just got smoked. Yeah, the Vikings just did not protect him this year. No. <laughs> he, had a, he had a good numbers year, but again, just the O-line just shit the bad last like, six games this season including the playoffs even the saints game was a bit of a sh- shitty fucking game but Drew, did you the find comment it? is i love how y'all are arguing over cards and or sorry cars and rob is just flexing in the background lmao exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark <laughs> three exclamation marks that's yeah. commitment is right it there. a girl there might even be four is it a girl Jaden c who and they have a no, nah, definitely not a girl. Oh man, they, they've got Rob's a, not interested anymore. They've got a sledge <laughs> picture as their profile picture. Oh, maybe oh, you never know these days. Yeah, <laughs> they could. And what was her name? Jade. Jaden. Jaden. Could be a girl. Maybe. Uh, could be your Jaden. <laughs> I'm out the sledge. Your your one lost love. If only that name wasn't bi or no, not bi heterosexual. Is that the right name? <laughs> yeah, like or word. When it, like if something can work for both. Yeah. No, Drew Barrymore. Yeah, you have one example. It's not heteros. Give me another. Or, isn't it? So I need no, Drew heterosexual Barrymore. means you're stupid. N- yeah, you're straight. <laughs> yeah, wait. What am I trying to think of? <laughs> Pansex? No. Gender neutral? No, there's a word no, that has no. sexual in it. I'm pretty sure. Uh, it's not bisexual. Uh, it's not bisexual for sure. Oh, and, and I pansexual can't think of means it. that you want to hook up with objects nope. all the time, right? Pansexual no, pan- means you. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what it means? Did I tell you that? I might have been fucking with you. I think it's, oh, maybe no. you did. And I just no. Pansexual <laughs> means that you're attracted to the person, not like their gender or anything. Like, which is let's say I. So you have to fall in love first. Like yeah, with their personality, like whatever their personality is, is what draws something you you've never felt. Not at all. <laughs> okay, what are we wait, girls have here? personalities? Girls have per- I thought uh, only had two personalities. Can be used for a guy and a girl, like a name. Uh, like, it's heterosexual, though. I no, swear. it's not. No. Heterosexual means you're straight. What's the word? Drew? I don't know. Are you, are your name. I'm trying to find out. Your name is heterosexual. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name just goes and meets a woman. Hi, my name's Rob. My name's heterosexual. How are you? I'm Rob, and I'm heterosexual. <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> oh my god, that's asexual. <laughs> Isn't asexual? No, no asexual that means that is. you're not attracted to anyone. Yeah, to anything. yeah, and it's not a choice. Wait, so pansexual means that you're sexually attracted to pans, yeah, like frying pans, right, and yeah. cutlery. Classic. Why cutlery? Why are you throwing cutlery? Just, just kitchen objects. <laughs> Oh, wait, are we just thinking of unisex? Unisex. Yeah, is that even a word? Yeah, Unisexual? Yeah, yeah. Unisex. Yeah. Unisex. I didn't even have okay. to look at it. I was just like, type, like, what are the different types of sexuality? I'm just like, wait, <laughs> no, unisex. not sexuality. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, because remember when I was a kid, my hairdresser used to say unisex on it. And I was like, oh, unisex. Like, I thought it might have something to do with like unicorns. <laughs> but like this is i was also like a long long the time one that ago. always made me laugh is like in ontario there's so many towns called middlesex yeah <laughs> yeah it's a county it's a county oh whatever same thing middlesex but yeah same county. idea who cares it's the fucking boonies no one lives out there we don't care about them hey we care about them mm-hmm. no that's where all the rich people live that's all where all the mennonites live they're middlesex? not listening to this podcast we they're rich though yeah I mean, if, they, if they give me money then because that's all, all they, the that's where all the land is to build their nice houses if you ever literally just like drive 10 minutes that way it's just mansions there was a oh actually you know this girl that i'm talking about remember the one who time? is she um what's her name and address the one that lives kind of close to where my mom i don't remember what her name was oh but the one that was, had the big, yeah yeah her um she had like a massive mansion on the massive. country like, You're talking massive like massive. four car garage and then an extra three car garage on the side As you and do. then to drive in it's like a 500 meter driveway with like a circle at the end we somehow um, both know the most random people together yeah. like will her yeah and then um, i know will too so inside he's her, like hockey with him he went to my and then he was yeah, always yeah, like, yeah. he was always like will and then he came over to shades for board games like will like, <laughs> um but anyway so her her mansion Willy. was Willy. like heated floors everywhere as you do you were in her house yeah yeah i mean like, I, was, I was out with my friends um and then they were like oh we're going to this and you hearing sure. this <laughs> um but, so no, you have heated <laughs> floors no Heated oh. floors everywhere. The chairs. I remember they were like, "Oh yeah, this one chair is like three thousand dollars." Like what? Yeah, I, just I, I remember when they first moved in. It was just like a typical like 
chair. Like, I don't know how just else to describe chair, it. Yeah. Like, you guys know the chair from Ikea that you guys are <laughs> sitting in? got a $2,000 office chair, and he's just chirping other people for say. their chair choices. <laughs> That's like an office chair. It's different than just you having three of them in your living room, and then just like, oh, yeah. Just That's sit. where they sit the most. Imagine every uh, chair in her house was one of the ones Christian has. Like, <laughs> <laughs> You sit at a dining room table. So it's a bunch of ergonomic gaming chairs. <laughs> but the thing that like um, baffled me the most is that so like out in the country, you can't get good internet, right? Like you're lucky if you get satellite. Like internet. you either have mm-hmm. really shit internet or really good internet because to someone be, had to wire so, it to your house. To be they fair, pay, they're not that out in the country. They're still far enough away. It, it's like they're out of the like the zone that we would. hundred percent. Yeah. And they they paid for fiber to be wired to their house. Yeah. That's like a couple hundred thousand dollars to do. Easy. Yeah. Well, like one kilometer of fiber optic is like 75K. Yeah. Right there. Buddy. And it's like at least four or five kilometers out. <laughs> it's oh. insider knowledge, but oh. I picked this up at work. Oh, shucks. They had to like leave one of their garages empty for a year. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Oh, no. no, man. And the funny, she's like the most down to earth girl, yeah. too. Like, she is surprising. so Wait, chill. How, would I know her? No, <laughs> no, probably not. She are went you, to my school. Are you sure? No, I'm kidding. She <laughs> went to my school. Well, I might have known. She's her. so down to earth, but then she'd like randomly come home one day and they just brought her like a brand new Jeep Cherokee, like Roadhawk, whatever. But yeah, they were telling when we were Road there, Hawk? they were like, oh, yeah, whatever. whatever. Watch. Watch. Nighthawk like, or. No, as you do. Okay. Yeah, it's nuts. But like, she's, their whole family is just like super chill, which is mm, fucked. That's fucked. That's good why, because they're like, we're so rich, but people are going to try and kill us, so we might as well make as many friends as we can. True. Not even. They're just like, they're just really chill people. Mm-hmm. Or they have people like you guys that just keep them grounded. Mm-hmm. Or, uh, them that well, <laughs> if this girl's still, this this girl still around and single, you could, you know, start dating. She 100% has a boyfriend. Sign a, sign a prenup. <laughs> Why would you sign a prenup? That'd that would be awful you get for you. <laughs> well, most sign a prenup. <laughs> <laughs> and Cancel then, that. And then I'll... Uh, That's Rob's way in. He's like, I'll sign a prenup. You just buy everything. And then, I'll, together. And then I'll orchestrate one of my friends to, like, you know, put the movies on her. And then I can accuse her of cheating on me, and then I'll take all the money, half the money. I don't think that's how the court works. But it's, in like the, it's, it's written them. in the prenup. Yeah. Yeah, 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 100%. Adultery is like definitely you could go after a prenup for that. Exactly. But like you couldn't, the it's, court wouldn't be like, but okay, it's you literally, owe them half your fortune. But it's literally <laughs> written in. If you did it for three months, you cheated on me. <laughs> Yeah, you just have to write what in. your prenup is. Yeah, yeah. But or like, even hush money, man. I'll make a big enough scene. They'll be like, give me 2000 bucks every week or I'm going to come to your house and scream my head off. Wait, all, <laughs> legally, can you put anything you want in the prenup? Yeah. I have no idea what have, it is, to be honest. As long as you have witnesses and two signatures. But is a, so what is a prenup? It's like a, a, a legal document. agreement. Saying like, so, if we get divorced, here's what happens. It's yeah. an agreement before your marriage. It could, I think, it could mean more than just divorce. I think mm-hmm. you could use it for like anything. It's legally. It might binding, be called something different. But it, just, it literally like, means just pre-nuptial, like what's, pre-marriage. What's, what's nuptials mean? I'm pretty sure it your means marriage. like sounds a lot like nipple. Is, is it be that. specific to marriage though? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Nup, pre-nuptial. I'm pretty sure that means like just before marriage. But it's legally binding, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. If you both sign it, blah, and blah, have blah. witnesses. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you have to firm handshake. You have to spit and shake hands. Mm-hmm. We have to shake on the five dollars for the rock climbing. $10. Wait, okay, what's the official bet? Okay. So ten yeah. so ten dollars. Okay. That he will climb a harder uh like route than me. So like you would have to fail on it. No, like how you have to it? climb like a V five. Because that's what he's saying that he could do. I'm, okay, no, no, okay. Like, oh, so I'll hash this out. So it would be something that Christian, like you climb and then Christian has to complete. So if at any point that he climbs something and then you can't complete it, does that make sense? But that, like, no, but when we were talking about it, I was just like, I can do like a V4. He's like, I can do a harder one than that. Well, like there's so, no way of proving that now because you can't do a V4 at the well, new gym. That's, it's like, right. okay, then if he can do a V4 and I can't. No, like, I feel like we need to stack the odds a little in my favor. Yeah, I'm saying... <laughs> I feel like I can, <laughs> I'm better than you. I will do better than you. I'm, I'm willing for, to bet on for, it. For yeah. Rob to win, you have to do anything in the gym, any wall in the gym that Christian can't. It has to be specific it, to that day. Yes. Yeah. Why yeah. Do, no, I would why say it has to be at least a V4. Because that's literally what he said. Because if you can't do a V3, I, he I know, can do. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Yeah, but that's that's his problem. <laughs> if he no, if he not. if he can't if he can't do a, if he does a V3 that you can't do, he technically did a climb that you can't do. Yeah. So we should time it. And you it's said that V3 is like... I see, I have wanted to time like an easy climb so you can do it faster, but I feel like I just beat everybody that, like, every wait, time. You just fucking... You the, just the skip on the fucking one, yeah, the orange one where he just skipped I showed, everything? I yeah. Told, I told Drew. Oh, I, I got like, that one, by the way. I haven't done it yet, but I, I can wait. try it. No, not the, not the one oh. at the back. The one in the middle boulder. I was oh. like, yo, Drew, come try this. The side where Bree was working. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. there's a route in the front of the gym where like you have to start kind of crouched and there's a giant black triangle in your way and the 
goal or for the whole route, you're supposed to go around the triangle, climb on top of it, and then go up, right? So I'm yeah. doing it, and then when I got to the one point where you're supposed to like transition back over the triangle, my foot was stuck because the like, black triangle was in the way, so I was like, oh, whatever, I got off. I left and, it for another time. And say in total, there's like 15 holes. Yeah. Okay. And then Shane, <laughs> just on the starting hold, skips six of them, reaches <laughs> up and past the triangle bit, and then reaches up again, past like three more, and is done. I use like five holes. Well, it's you can frustrating. Do it, you can do yeah. it, right? Oh, it's just annoying when, like, it's like he's so tall that he but can do that. This one I did this, and I was like, God, this fucking sucks. Yo, Drew, come here. I did this climb. You can too. And then watching him try to navigate around everything. <laughs> it was Which great. Case. Case. It's the orange one beside where Bree was working. Did I do it? No. You got oh. to the same spot he did, and you're like, yeah. what the fuck? And came down. My knee was like just stuck behind the black triangle. I was like, all right, fuck this. But regardless, so I, I think, I I think it has to be back. timed, man. If we have to choose a wall, we can both no, do it. No, no, you, you, you don't want time, to be timed. Time is dumb. Yeah. Why? Again, I think it's if. To be it's going to be a lot harder than you think it is. Okay, how about we just... Okay, well, Shakes now to put $5 or $10 no, in no, the No, no, no. We, we got to hash it out. We, no, but then we can... 100% have Part of the agreement will be... No, no, no. When, I want to get there and see things for I make no, the bad. No, yeah. Again, no, I think the no, fairest no, no, no. thing... Like, odds are going to be in Christian's favor no matter what. Yeah. yeah. I think the fairest thing is if you do a climb that he can't during the night. Because I, I, I feel so like too. that's completely okay. fair. I think, I think we should put some limitations on how many attempts each of you gets before, like... We'll do what we did with mine. You get, like, what, two or three? Yeah, and actually, no. Like, we said just one for us. But Rob's but. also new. Like Christian will have technique that he doesn't. Yeah. Yeah, but I have raw power, man. I, I I'm an, I'm, I I'm a northern. I, I, all right. My, my only right. concern is that there's gonna be one where it's like the green one that I was trying to do the V4, where it's like the only hard part is just the starting hold, and then Rob's just gonna fucking like punch a hole in the rock <laughs> and then just hold himself. I'll, See, make, but I'll like, make my own hole. Green hold's a perfect example. A, I don't know if he's gonna even be able to grip those. B, he's not gonna be able to transfer his weight mm -hmm. proper. Well, like for the V2, V3s, though, there are some that I feel like he could maybe just power weight. But okay, I, but okay the way I've been watching you climb, though, Can I roll is you've your guys' done... chalk? Yeah. Oh, well, they have free chalk there. Yeah. Okay. You, they just have you have not chalk. Fuck it. Whatever. There we All go. Right. There it is. Who cares? Both are equally oh. clammy hands. Like, <laughs> yeah. Oh, I heard it like uh, yeah. Yeah. that Drew clap foot sound. <laughs> that's, <laughs> yeah. that's some solid Corona transmission. But again, yeah. you haven't really struggled Wolves on any V2 or V3 in a while. Except that blue one we were doing the other day, which yeah, was balls. Yeah, I can't fucking do that one. Hopefully but you know what I mean. So, so I has to be... screenshot that handshake and just make it a picture. That one I couldn't do, though, because my <laughs> shoulder. I was holding myself up, and I honestly thought my shoulder was about to tear. Yeah, watch so me, watch me, okay. Day of, oh, my shoulder. That counts as me That counts as me winning $10. If anyone leaves now, like if you were to bail, last second that's 10 bucks 10 or if he's to bail last second there you go. Extra, extra incentive for rob to be there yeah. so for anyone bucks. that rob gets you get two tries to get the same one if sure. you don't Christian, get one go, straight boom. up go in do your warm-up um do the red v2 on the, the overhang wall and realistically you've won yeah because that will take three turns just to try to figure out all the moves. Because there's so many moves. Wait, is it so Rob starts it and then I have to complete oh, it? Or I, it doesn't I, matter. It doesn't way. matter. Either yeah, way. either okay. way. I think it should only be that way, but I'm also not in the bet, so I don't give a shit. So I'll, I'll yeah, I'll just do the for right Rob's, Rob's sake. Fucked. I think it should be that way. <laughs> all the holds are good, but it's like a, it's a long. How many tries do I get? Just as many as I can. Yeah, sure. Yeah, we'll okay. give you as many as you want. Sure. Okay. The and goal, the goal of this, it. the goal of this exercise is to get a good workout in and have you both leave at zero. You know, and also yeah. have you get addicted to rock climbing? Well, you're not gonna get addicted, but maybe pop in, you know, once every month ish. Yeah, once every, you know, every every harvest moon. Sure, <laughs> we'll take it. You guys ever wonder that He'll if we didn't do this addicted. podcast, how often we would see Rob? I'd still, I'd still hang out. Like, I, I'd come to your board. Like the board game night was fun. Board game day. nights have dried up as of as late. I need yeah. to plan well, I mean, aside That's from today, when, today, but yeah, when uh, <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, Drew's done at three, and I was like, Shane's free. Oh, let's done. Come over play board games. Yeah. I had a haircut yeah. and then had to get to the gym. And for once, I was actually ahead of schedule on videos, so we'll take it. Everything was Let's good. Go. How's the channel been doing? I haven't haven't asked or um, seen in a while. It's been doing good. Let me pull. Like he so, lost thirty thousand subs. Yeah, it's a fucking lost. Disaster. How come? <laughs> what are you guys looking at? Nothing. Two um, one. Two lease. one. Lease. Muzzy's Overall, back. Willie Barry. Muzzy's no. back. Uh -oh. Willie and Hyman. Oh. Yeah. Ew. Overall, videos Unassisted. have been. He was a greasy goal. <laughs> Okay, anyways, just... Videos have been like half and half. They either get like 90k views or some of them go up to like 150, but most of them are like around 90 to 100. That's huge. That's, that's not a, bad. That's barely it, it's yeah. good. Only like... 90,000 people watching a video. Or 100. What, Crazy. Sucks, what sucks is that like I talked to a bunch of other creators about this and they all had the same thing was that just June last year was the greatest thing ever. Like I was averaging 250 to 300k videos or views per video, no matter Damn. what it was. And then, as, 
I think it was just uh, they were really Perfect Storm? Just like, like Ubisoft was promoting the shit out of Siege like I think there were ads everywhere well there was people... a free week, week for it too right it, that there? happens every season oh. so that wasn't really a factor but like it's just they I think there was a huge marketing push for it and it really brought a lot of views in and then ever since then we've been trying to like relive that mm-hmm. and then I had that incident in September where my video got demonetized and then the channel went to shit for that oh. after a while that and then sucks. now it's like climb back up to where it was we're back baby we're back it's, we out now, here. it's now finally back to i think before june mm-hmm. so it's like i lost six months of progress but it's still you didn't, really, decent. Well, you didn't lose anything right you were still yeah. bringing in mm-hmm. stuff i remember so. when christian was talking to me like just out of an exam he's like yeah maybe by the end of the year i'll have 100k subs uh-huh. and he was just so excited about it and now he's like oh fuck there's I'll climb into a million. Yeah. Fuck those hundred K subs. No, um, yeah. I lost three views. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, right now we average twenty two thousand subs per per month. day. No per month. <laughs> uh, like per so hour. <laughs> December was eighteen K. Ninja. <laughs> December was eighteen K, but that's because we lost two K in one day. Oh, she has a giant dip in yeah. that month. But like most months are like uh, twenty to twenty two K. Like this month has already been 20k and the month's not even over. Ooh. Um, so like, another, like, realistically, 21, 21, 21, realistically 21. we should reach um, 1 mil by October. Was that thing you were going to tell me earlier? And 1 mil is the goal. I can't yeah. talk about it on the podcast. Oh. oh. Money moves. I told Drew about it. Money. But I, yeah, I can't talk about it on the was, podcast. Uh, was good. Like to any extent? No. No. Okay. Well, um, to anyone listening, you're just as confused as <laughs> Shane and I are, at least. No, you told me to. Oh, so I'm just <laughs> yeah, the odd one out here. Yeah, definitely but all I'll, three of us know. Yo, well, what I'll else tell you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, <laughs> what else are you keeping? <laughs> <laughs> Don't Jedi check the basement. Trick. There is no basement. Or I guess there is technically. What's even down there? <laughs> There's dead people <laughs> everywhere. The well, cars. There's, there's a parking people. garage. <laughs> Yeah, you should oh, see yeah, us in the shit. trunks. There's more than nine levels. Fuck. There's probably there's like a McLaren down there. Oh, Ooh. we should go spit on it. This guy keeps thinking it's a Lamborghini. Well, he's like, yo, a Lamborghini, yeah, Lamborghini McLaren. <laughs> it's a, it's, yo, it's a Lamborghini Mercy Claren, bro. Mercy Lagardo. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> it's, it's a Lamborghini Gala Mercy Lago, man. Come on, figure it out. <laughs> nice. Galaventador. <laughs> nice. Actually, sounds like a real name. It like Galaventador. Pokemon. Uh, Pokemon. Oh, <laughs> Pokemon. Pokemon. Yeah, did you guys ever watch Digimon? I did actually. Mm, I a used little to be bit. The biggest Digimon fanboy, but I can't remember anything about. Yeah, it. I, I, I had a video game. It was your racing agree. Digimon game. I just had. I remember fun. having this one Digimon movie on VHS, and like the opening song just like gives me so much nostalgia. But I couldn't tell you one thing that happens in that movie. I don't even remember how like Digimon works. I don't remember I, how they play that or anything. I think it's pretty similar. Honestly, kind of like from my memory. Don't quote me on any of this. It kind of seems like That's a like Pokemon. Quoting, 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 quoting. <laughs> kind of seems like a Pokemon Yu Gi Oh crossbreed. The fuck. Because <laughs> yeah, like they, they didn't have fuck you say. They didn't have cards. They didn't have like Pokeballs. They had cards. But, it was like, wasn't oh, it like oh, oh, gotcha. electronic cards or something? Like, like it, wasn't it like an SD card? Just like a SIM like, card. I, I think it <laughs> was. You've Googled, it was like, I, I need, you've Googled way too much things today. Yeah. Yeah. It's supposed to be a conversation and you know you can't focus on your phone and conversation. We're just going to pull up the Leaf score now and be like, oh, wow, they're down zero to eight. Who would have thought? Let's, Google I need to, let's have a the record vote. show I'm Googling Digimon. Vote that Drew does not bring his phone to podcast next mm-hmm. next session. Let the record <laughs> show the Leafs are winning. <laughs> I'll just bring a toddler instead. <laughs> He shows up his, his computer. <laughs> he plugs that fucking desktop. Brings in like Google Glass. Yeah, <laughs> just, like, exactly. Yo. In the middle of the conversation, just looking up. Apparently, <laughs> those things sucked. I think yeah, probably, I, I think technology well. isn't at that stage where you can like make a commercial, like commercially scaled VR so, product, and it not be shit. I don't know how true this is, but what I heard is that the reason why Google Glass failed is not because of the limitations of technology. But because of like limitations of laws and stuff, that they wouldn't allow certain things. Like what? Like what would what would restrict a VR device? Though I, I'm not like too you sure couldn't on the wear it while driving or something. Yeah, so I think it was like the driving and also like or what, what it's able to do <laughs> or sleeping and yeah. like it inhibiting your view and stuff. Like there was just all this legality stuff behind it, and then also there was something about uh, they could have made it better, but people wanted it to be slim and look like normal set of glasses. Mm-hmm. But like you can't do that with VR. Like you need to put the technology somewhere. So You're people were just saying like, "Oh, we want it smaller. Like, it's gonna be more limiting, smaller." It's like nah, there's nothing right. you can do. 
So there's just yeah, like there's legality yeah. and customers just not knowing what they were getting into. Like oh, that's I, more big pharma at work for you. Big mm-hmm. pharma. Mm-hmm. Coming from someone who worked at a VR place, which I've probably mentioned before. Mm-hmm. I've, t- mm-hmm. I've, I've talked about it probably a thousand times in my that. lifetime. Did I? Like for real? Yeah. It was one of his co-ops. My first co-op was a VR place. It was pretty, no pretty cool. No idea. Really? Yeah. But like it wasn't like a VR no, arcade it or wasn't anything. Like it was a, like a company that made virtual reality things. Like it was like so company, just an office job. Yeah, they still no idea. Okay. They would like a so, backup job. Sort of like for context, no. there was like they would do two <laughs> things. Games. Stupid. They would go into like student housing and like scan it and create like three D panoramic pictures out of oh. it and then like stitch it together into tours and like have virtual tours. So it was like that guy on Reddit. There's a guy. There's a yeah, there's a million kinda, yeah, guys yeah, on the Reddit dude with the v- we were oh, talking yeah, about yeah, that. Yeah. 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 Um, and, but then they would also do the same thing for like pre-built properties where they would like render them in 3D like, modeling programs and then do the same thing. So it was really cool actually. But I remember my boss was talking to me one time about it and he's just like, he's like, you know, I have a lot of faith in VR, but I just think it's just one of those things that you, I just don't think is ever going to be able to take that next step into like being a general consumer like product just because one confusion around like what it's what it, what it does and then what it can do for you and two no matter what you're putting on some sort of device right yeah and that's a huge turn off for like half people like i went to trade shows and stuff and like doing live demos with it people just don't want to put it on because one they think oh it's gross people are sharing it right you know what i mean and that's two yeah. it's like people like do their hair and makeup and whatever mm-hmm. and they don't want to put on a device that would potentially i don't I, know. I think the market is definitely bigger for augmented reality yeah ar because off your like pokemon go type thing right i think that's a lot more accessible or even just like wearable ar like it just has well, so I, many I, more the, uses i found like the, just any like anytime you're requiring someone to put on a device it's just a huge turn off for them for the well, most part but like it depends like if you get glasses versus a whole headset yeah it's yeah very gla- different. Exactly. which is why google exactly. glass was so popular for a bit well yeah because that was Cause augmented well, like the idea of it was really popular and then yeah. no one really bought it yeah. as far as i know it was also really i expensive. think there's new ones too I, I saw some new some new birds, some chick on youtube was like sponsored for it and just like walking around with glasses they were like they were like more like robs but then like thick sides no. they're just gunners <laughs> gunner optic <laughs> blue light shield yeah play all day and night did you change the thing the ravens did with ar when they had that giant raven flying around oh, the yeah, stadium was nuts. yeah so a football team actually used ar they like created like a uh oh. a, do you see that raven the big no. bird thing but basically, they had this. Giant... <laughs> no, I haven't seen that. <laughs> they had this giant bird like flying around the stadium. I'm like, not gonna lie, it looked it looked sick. really cool. And all you had to do was download an app and look at everything with your phone, and the phone like projected it. That's yeah. really cool. But like, wait, so how did you guys see it? Just like someone recorded, like, someone recorded it on their phone and just put a video up on. And I think did the you, Ravens uh, himself posted the video. Yeah. Did you guys watch the All Star game for the hockey? I watched oh, like a bit of. No, it. I just watched like the, the. So did did the you watch? Game. Did you watch the Canada versus U.S. women's game? No, I it's didn't. garbage. It was actually a really good game, but they had. Yeah. No, they they was it was actually okay, a very one. good game. Two one. For yeah. Canada. Canada. Woo-woo. <laughs> Two and, one. Uh, <laughs> anyway, they had they had a puck tracker and it was awful. Like it was cool. It was so annoying. It was cool from like a technology perspective, but it technology. was so technology. Technology. <laughs> it was so annoying to watch. Like it yeah. literally was just like a trail following the puck everywhere. It's like playing NHL. But, but then it, they could track like puck speed and they tracked like the speed of every individual but player. But here's the thing, uh-huh. they can do that without putting some fucking shitty ass cursor trail on yeah, the yeah, screen. Yeah, like, yeah, that's but, pretty much like, the equivalent of this. So a cursor trail. You guys are reminding me a lot of my YouTube community because whenever I use the eye tracker for videos, I'm like, oh, just so you guys know, there's an eye tracker in this. Everyone in the comments is like, I fucking hate this. Turn it off. <laughs> and, and there's a few people like, I like it. It adds a little level of depth. And everyone's like, fuck this shit. Turn it I feel off. like that's slightly different though because it's like already a video game. But like when you're watching people in real life play a sport and you then there's the like a is. CGI puck. Yeah, like you know where the puck is too. There's like this CGI puck going everywhere. It's just like... Okay, so the thing is, is like you, you would, go like, where people are going. Know, okay, you just follow. This is, everyone's skating somewhere for some reason. They were playing three on three. Yeah, you can figure out where the puck uh, is yeah. real quick, <laughs> and then you got this again. Stoop, and the color it was like a brown cursor trail. Yeah, yeah. Oh, like it was brown. Someone shit themselves. Shit out of a fucking puck. But again, like it just made no sense. Again, the stats they can show you are sweet. Yeah, but yeah. again, you can show me the stats without the shitty do cursor. Want, the new tech I like in football is when they do a field goal and it shows how far it would have been good from. You yeah. know what I mean? It's like. Good. It was it was good for fifty five, but like the arc and the speed. He could made, have kicked a sixty. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's uh, one of the things I like too. Like if they like 
literally just move it. Yeah, back. yeah, yeah. Exactly. which is cool. fascinating. Yeah, they, it's yeah, really they cool have to everything see. from like the launch angle to the how much how how much power he generated yeah it's sweet now did you guys know that the uh so you know how in football they have the yellow line or whatever that yeah. pops yeah. up when they're like oh you first get, down yeah, yeah that thing um <laughs> did you know that that like won an oscar when it was created what the fuck no it was like what, the, what? like technology it, i think it was like in 2001 or something or at least i think it the was first time it wanted some won type of an oscar. award because of the, it said that the technology at the time was amazing like groundbreaking even, in because, all honesty though even now having like the the first the, downline and it and stuff, changes everything it's yeah fucking, like it's amazing and how well it integrates like it just looks flawless it's perfect yeah, yeah it's literally perfect yeah. and now they do if they're if you're like they know the field goal range of the kickers oh, yeah, they have the field so goal then they'll put like too, a, yeah. you have to get to this line on the field for the kicker to have a chance at kicking the field yeah. goal like I mean, a good chance or like they call it and, field goal range just and, like and the they spe- smallest, it's specific yeah. to whatever kicker but like holy it, shit, i think it goes to their so career good. long it goes to that yeah but it's so good yeah and you're right like you can it's fascinating because people can run on the line you know what i mean they can do whatever you want on the line the line always stays doesn't move and it always has like perfect tracking around the people yeah. like it's, it's it, without amazing. being the green they've screen. done a lot mm-hmm. for football yeah. i think well, i mean the like, field's green but but apparently the like help yourself <laughs> apparently it's like the amount of work and time screen man <laughs> the amount of work and time it took to make that was like crazy. i can't imagine yeah it was like they dedicated <laughs> millions of dollars to that. again and it's one of those things like you wouldn't think cost a lot but i think it did a lot for the game oh, even yeah. just don't watch it well, it's it makes a lot it, easier it makes casual fans understand what's going on okay mm-hmm. why are like, where are they working towards yo speaking of which i watched golf with my grandpa on sunday it's sick go tiger it was awesome, mm-hmm. dude. And two of them like hit the fucking flag, and I'm like, oh. that's pretty jokes. <laughs> My like with sport, I watch, but like where I, I and I love, but like no one else, I, I love watching tennis. It's so yeah. fucking yeah. sick. It's like it's sick. I don't go out of my way to watch, but sometimes I just want to watch on, Sports it's Center. Like two hours later, and yeah. you're like, what I'll watch the, the hell? big tennis matches at least. Like I, I, I go to watch Sports Center, and then like tennis is on, and like fuck. But I'm like, okay, I might I'm as well watch some tennis. Rounick's in the quarterfinals tomorrow. He's a Canadian tennis player. Sure. Um, oh, huge. Yeah, and yeah. he's huge playing like long. he's playing like the number one Djokovic. He's playing the number one dude in the world, the or maybe number two. Regardless, the dude's amazing. Yeah, yeah. he's about to get killed. That's hope. But, uh, or that's not hope, actually. Oops. We'll see. Again, right. Roundich, he has the best serve in the league, so we'll see. I would say, for uh, speaking of like sports that <laughs> you love watching, um, what I've realized <laughs> how much I love watching now is <laughs> curling. Curling like, so I, I used sick. to love it. I Fuck off. would watch it's so, it all the time. so good, man. It's so fun to watch. Me and Annie would go to like Firehouse Subs. Annie, no. and Whatever. And then uh, there's <laughs> like call. the TVs everywhere, and there's curling on. I'm not Love talking it. to Annie. I'm yeah. just sitting there watching curling. And Man, that's like... I'm trying to explain everything to her and she's like, I don't understand any, any of Any pub that has darts, I am laser focused on that. The TV. dart highlights... 180! It is the most ridiculous sport. They're all just playing... There's like two people playing darts and the background is just a drunk fest. Yeah. But there's like, like hundreds pitchers, and hundreds of people. People dressed up, like they're just slamming pitchers on the <laughs> yeah. desk. They're getting fucked. My, and it's, then they hit a 100 throw like... Yeah. Yeah, everyone's freaking the fuck out. By far the best part about the dart tournaments is the athletes who like show up yeah, and it's yeah. just like in the left they corner drink. we have a guy who's like 250 pounds like the biggest <laughs> bear gut you'll ever see he has like shaming he has i mean like he has like <laughs> a kidding. mohawk on one side but then like dreads on the other <laughs> and then he just got like one eye closed it's a world and they, literally, they like go down and like in between their shots they just like pour themselves a new beer from their pitcher they're just like <laughs> beer in one hand just like yeah all right. in the other <laughs> did you see that uh I think it was like the first female to ever win a darts I tournament. Yeah, she's nuts. Yeah, I did not. She's cracked. Darts People were like going crazy over like, it. Like they're they're so they're they're not progressive at all. As in like females get paid like one tenth of what yeah. the males do. Which so makes for no her sense to... because like darts is not something that requires like the physical strength Correct. that like yeah, football. Yeah, yeah. And I was watching. They all they almost be better because it's think pretty think much like it. a one. It's like a massive I think bracket, and you slowly close in on the finals. And she was making a run, tearing through some of the best people. Damn. And then I'm pretty sure she didn't end up winning, but, but she was close. close. There was one girl who won like the big tournament, whatever the hell. I it saw is. a video of that on Twitter, but yeah, where but anyway, like everyone was like hugging her. You were roasting out. curling. Yeah, when, I went, when there's I moments where there's like th- like what do you even call it? When there's three rocks near the center, and the guy like hits three in a row. I saw to put that. his center, but like it happens all. It's I just amazing. think it's because like I, I, I got. Sorry, I got to watch that uh, in the middle of like Firehouse. Was like, I was looks- freaking the <laughs> fuck out. And yeah. it's just, it's like, I feel like it was a clone of when you guys saw the Grand Slam at yeah, the yeah. game, and I was just sitting there like, whatever. This is amazing. That's how I felt. I was like, oh my God, the technique. I just think I hate curling because when I was a kid at my grandparents' place, like, 
when I was like young, young, I didn't know the difference between NFL and college, but I just knew I wanted to watch football. Mm -hmm. But my grandpa always had curling on. Curling's it's great. an old person. But I, when I retire, that's what I'm going to do. Probably. Like, it looks fun. I know people who go curling. My uncle does. But We could make a team. It's four people for a team. I, I really want to take Christian golfing this summer. Golf. I'm, I'm I've golf. never golfed on an actual course before. I've only ever been to a drive. I'll, I'll, I'll only do, do it just because. We'll I'll go. only do it if I have a caddy. I'm not carrying my own clubs. Okay, well, Wait, I'm not going to be a caddy. Well, just, maybe you Dude. rent a cart. Or we get. That's or, still too much work. Or we can literally just like split a set of clubs. Can we get a chauffeur? Probably. Okay, I can't, but you guys can. Yeah, Drews are probably oompa loompa sized. You're gonna <laughs> get like the normal regulation size. I'm gonna get like a slightly smaller one. Drews gonna get like the mini putt. <laughs> yeah, they're all plastic clubs. <laughs> I'm gonna use Man, a fucking sledgehammer. Man, we should 100 just go hit up a par three. Yeah, 100%. a par three. Bring, bring. Uh, we should, I, I can bring my driving 60 range. degree, and I can bring my putter, and I'll beat all Dude, your let's asses. Go to, let's go to the indoor driving range over by the. We're two clubbing uh, it. Christian's like out. 60 degree. What? What the fuck? I'll bring like I a know, four and a putter. I know very little ass. about golf, but if I was better friends with this family friend of ours, I could probably get us into a club for free because he owns one of the bigger ones in Toronto. Just be better oh, friends yikes. with them. Yeah. Yeah. Don't know him that well. So <laughs> My grandpa keeps trying to give me all of his tailor maids, and I should just be like, yeah. Just take them and sell them. Why not? True. Or give them to me and I'll sell them. Just keep it. It's not like a golf club goes bad. Just keep it for that one time a year. If you're going into like like the financial area... You're going to need to know. know how to golf. Yeah. I know. Like, well, I know how. Man, I did golf lessons growing up. But you up. know what I mean? You're going to need to actually golf. Yeah, and yeah. And we go mini golfing. And Drew pulls out his fucking bag. <laughs> and goes like, what's the win? Like, right? He has a caddy. I, I, I've low-key brought my putter to mini golf. Thing. We've played mini golf a couple of times. I think I don't think I've ever <laughs> lost to you. I don't know about you. I never lost to you. Mm. Not in putt-putt. I think no. I went with you and Amanda once, too. Yeah, I, I know we killed you. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh yeah, I beat Amanda. Yeah, yeah, that's but I, that's Amanda. Although, like, yep. we've played four rounds this year because we were in Frankenmuth. They have a course, and she beat me already. So it's not Oof. it's not a good start. I'm only three. And I just want to see Christian swing a golf club. That'd be so funny. It, it's just fucking feels weird. Even to me, I, I kind of like know how to swing. It feels weird. Keep your head down. I always hockey it. I put my hands too far apart at first. Yeah. I'm like, oh You're wait, literally I can't supposed do this. to like interlace your fingers. Yeah, and Rob's like, uh, I'm just so used to doing hockey style, man. I, I took golf lessons as a kid, and I actually started doing pretty well. That's what messed up his back. But then like, I just never really could get into it. Mm -hmm. I mean, I I mean but like golf lessons and playing, like they're way like, different. It's way different when you're taking a lesson and when you're like out on a course Keeping oh, yeah. with, a, with a golf cart, like so, getting a couple beers just with your friends. Cigars. Like, chilling. Well, I, I need my strawberry daiquiris. But... The yeah, they, 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 that's fine. The, we'll the get one, you some. The one issue I'd have with going golfing is that I would know I'm so bad that no, I would no, not no. want anyone to be waiting behind me. So I'd be you see, that's it. You'd have you have to just, a, you let people, find a dead day. Yeah. Yeah. Or you let people pass. Like, you can let people play through. It's not a big deal. Like you just you just hold up at the hole and then if they're just like yeah play through. I have buddies still. just like get fucked and go golfing like oh, all yeah. the time. Like they go with I get to the thing like at ten a.m. They're playing Snapchats, just like hacking darts, boozing at like eleven in the morning, <laughs> just playing golf. It takes like four hours to finish what they're doing. Man, like four they, hours isn't even like that crazy for eighteen no. holes. The appeal is you just like hang out with your friends and like hit a, hit some balls. I don't want to hang out with you guys. <clears throat> okay, that's, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> Last thing about sports. R the Super Bowl happens before our next pod. Yeah. So we should put our predictions oh, out. Oh, is there. it this weekend? I'm not saying anything. Let's hear the predictions. Oh, man. Yeah, don't tell them. Don't say the teams. Let's hear it. San Francisco. And? Cowboys. Nope. Mm -hmm. They're in the same conference. That couldn't be a Super Bowl. San Francisco and Green Bay Packers. Same. Baltimore same Ravens. Close. Very close. Uh, not really. They the Minnesota up. Vikings. Oh, no. uh, I, knew, I thought you were going to say that earlier, to be honest. Right, I was waiting for it. I honestly don't remember what the other team is. So it's San Fran, the 49ers, versus KC. Oh, Kansas City. Yeah. yeah. The Chiefs. Chiefs. Showtime Mahomes. Uh, you couldn't have made it any easier for I, him. Well, <laughs> KC. Chiefs 24 to 17. That's almost like fourteen. That's the most average football prediction ever. Twenty four. I'll be honest. I thought the Chiefs were Dallas. <laughs> the Dallas, the Dallas Chiefs. <laughs> the Dallas Chiefs. Kind of and, then, and then the Kansas City Cowboys. I guess just as well, like, I it. said Cowboys. I was like, no. I remember you guys talking about Chiefs. I was like, is that Dallas? Dallas, no, Dallas, Chiefs? Dallas Cowboys. Mm -hmm. um, San Fran's gonna win. Cowgirls. I think the Chiefs are gonna win actually. Because here's my quick analysis. All right. San Fran and on to the next topic. <laughs> San Fran gets their <laughs> like gets their reputation by rushing and sacking quarterbacks, but they play against they haven't played against a mobile quarterback before, minus Lamar Jackson. And Lamar Jackson almost beat them. 
But Almost. He didn't. But like <laughs> Patrick Mahomes can throw while moving like the, Lamar the thing Jackson. Is, is like Lamar Jackson doesn't have as good of an arm, so that's but, fair. Yeah. But, but like, like San Francisco's pass defense is just as good as their they're, run. Dude, they have Sherman. Can you name another person in their secondary? You don't need to. Name name me the whole Baltimore secondary. They were garbage. Marlon uh, Humphrey than, is all pro. Correct. Jimmy Smith. But before this year. Before this year. Marcus Peters. Before pro this year. Bowl, that's three Pro Bowl players in the What's Baltimore secondary. What's the guy they got secondary. from Seattle? Uh, Diggs. Uh, no, what something the Diggs. Fuck's the dude. Bro, he was part of the Legion of Boom. He One was of the cousins. Richard Sherman. <laughs> no, in on Baltimore. Uh, from the LOB. Who I don't know who I went to LOB name. from. They had. Uh, We've spiraled. Doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah. So, anyways, <laughs> but what I'm saying is like Baltimore has a good secondary. Chiefs carved them. Like Patrick Mahomes, like he's mobile and he can throw. With the Niners, haven't seen that yet. Because they've only seen, dude, they've, their playoff games have been against Aaron Rodgers and Kirk Cousins, two least mobile quarterbacks in the league. Aaron besides Rodgers, Tom one Brady. of the most mobile quarterbacks I've ever seen. Not, he didn't play like that. He, no, didn't, he, leave didn't. The, he didn't leave the pocket. You know why? Because he game. literally couldn't. But he's Mahomes is faster. That's what I'm telling you. I think that we'll I think, see. I think the Chiefs win like 35, oh, six, 35, 20 or something that, like yeah. that. Yeah. I have one issue with all of this. Yeah. Why are you calling them the Niners? The 49ers? Because it's just Niners. Niners. Do you Niners, call them the bud. the Vikings? No, because the 49ers. Well, the Niners. <laughs> I call the Chiefs the the fuss. Yeah. <laughs> it's 49ers. Just call them. Everyone calls them the Niners, man. Yeah. Like everyone. Oh, sorry. San Francisco Niners, bud. I, I'm, I'm four years old. I, dro- I dropped the 20 you're, because, like, why would I say that? You're, you're 49. True. True. Yeah, true. You're 49. You're right. a Niner in my mind. We need a solid last topic. We also need to prompt the... Uh, comments since we didn't last time. Did All right, well, what are we asking the comments to Nate? Oh, I guess I was going to say, what, who's what going to win the Super Bowl? What was the first thing we even talked about on the podcast? We're, you guys were bickering about something. That's all I remember. Oh, but that's, that's Christian every being a freaking school teacher. Oh, yes. A shitty one at that. Was. Do you think Christian's a school teacher? <laughs> Which, if <laughs> Christian were to be a school teacher, what subject would he teach? I do not. <laughs> I do not like no. He said, he would, he I don't like where this is going. He's the gym teacher at football. <laughs> he's that teacher that he's there, but you actually have never had a class with him, and you don't know <laughs> what he does. He has all these rumors about the drugs that he did, and yeah. why he's never going to be the no, same again. No, Christian would be the teacher that hangs out in the special hallway all, all the time. Yeah. <laughs> he's the janitor. The janitor. <laughs> he teaches in like one portable that nobody's ever yeah, been the in. He teaches like that weird fucking like he, t- he teaches grade twelve French. No one takes that. Let's be real. Well, Rob, we know what type of teacher you'd be. I'd be a, you know, remember the one gym teacher we had at our school that got fired for being predatory? <laughs> That's if no, I wouldn't so you'd be, be that. Him. No, no, you were saying I, I would not be. be that. I'd be this the guy. Do you know? Do you remember who I'm talking yeah. about? What was the first letter of his last name? S. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. This guy him. was fucked. Like fucked. Like. So what was your point of that? You literally said, you know who I'm going to be? Remember this no, predatory that's, that's teacher? A, that's what you're going to be. He's like, he's going to be the opposite of that. That's what he was trying yeah, to say. I'm going to be a angelic Stay man. Out of there. I'm going to be like the best man at one of my exactly. students' right. weddings. Yeah. All right. That'd be we even need... weirder. No, Which, what, what type of teacher would all four of us be? I like that. Sure. That's what type point. of teacher? So like, like strict, like what sub- cool, well, like no, like more subject. subject. Oh. Both. All of the above. Okay. D. My kid, but you can't. I, I you can't say sex ed because I feel that everyone's just gonna say that. Yeah, yeah. Don't be trolls. I want to yeah. make predictions, but I don't want to influence the comments. No, on what just wait. You can't do it. You're not allowed. Fine. No. Je oui. suis no. Je that suis means I, no, no, I no. no. <laughs> Which is what happens. Puis aux toilettes, s'il vous plaît. Yes. Can you name it? Like, I, I can still speak perfect French if I have to go to the bathroom or it's all I'm know saying my say, name. Yeah. That's it. I, I oublié. No. O, o, <laughs> do, you remember, la bibliothèque. do you guys remember like the old, like no. the songs they would teach oublié. you for like the verbs and stuff? Sur, or, de bon <laughs> je or, vais, <laughs> or like la nana. I, I, la nana. I, I tell you a Ramstein song. <laughs> for all you Americans, la nana was this talking pineapple that was just like creepy as oh, fuck. Oh, la nana. Give him a quick Google. He's fucking scary. You didn't do that? No. Yeah, he's hey give give we, Lana now Google. He's we, we terrifying. Use no, Lana na. Dude, I had a Tintin, the I original had a, French. I had a quick thing with my old French teacher's daughter because she went to my school, and it was so weird. We were like on her webcam one day talking to her, and she's like, "Is that like Rob?" And I was like, "Yeah." Do you remember me? And she's like, "Yeah." She's like, Are you still raising hell all your classes? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was like, for the most part. What was the, the webcam? Was black. Uh, my like. 
What was her last name starting with? G. And then L. Girl. Oh. I'll show you a picture after. Yeah, I, don't, yeah. I don't remember the daughter, so. She actually ended up being a very... Heart, not heartbreaking, very Her frustrating situation. Girl. I'll put it that way. You are. Isn't that all Added of your girls? List. <laughs> Some of them are less frustrating than others, but um, my grade nine French teacher gave us all French <laughs> names, and mine was Auguste. And I'd always get in trouble. She'd be like, Auguste. Auguste what's that mean? <laughs> Auguste, it's clump. <laughs> Stop <laughs> eating the chocolate. She was just in the back. Just covered in chocolate. S- sniffing glue back Eating there. Eating his erasers. Well. <laughs> you know why she probably did that? It's because she didn't want to remember any of your names. Probably. So she, she's just she's like, like, I've memorized this list of 30 names. You get that one. You get that one. She put them in the same seat every time. One day, like, a girl's going to sit there and like, you're Auguste. Well, we get, we get to choose ours. Oh. Uh, yeah. I'm horrible with names, so I'd be a terrible teacher. Oh, I am too. You can be like, you'll introduce me to someone, I'll shake their hand, but I already forgot your name. Like, there's mm-hmm. guys I've been yeah. talking to at the gym for like five years, and like, I think neither of us know each other's names. That's why we always say, just call each but other like, bro or guy. Yeah, you know what I mean? Dude. I know, I know so many get people by the name, by just addressing them as, hey, what's up? You know what I mean? Just, hey, hey what's, what's up, up man? Hello. I'm trying to get better at that because, like, you know, like networking and all that, you'll yeah. like shake someone's hand, like, you know, you should, like, there's some VP, and then yeah. you're just like, <laughs> Sh- it's like Steve, right? What's that guy's name again? It's like you're Steve, right? No, I'm actually Charles, Fuck. man. But uh, <laughs> he's like, and I'm the hiring manager on this job you applied for. Fuck. <laughs> Which or I'm ripping your resume in half now? <laughs> or you oh. do the classic. Sorry, how do I spell your name again? Like B O B. Yeah. It's like how do I spell your name uh. again? It's like oh, uh, what you have? What you have to begin with? It's like uh, A. <laughs> <laughs> can, can I buy a vowel? <laughs> <laughs> Something just pops up. Just like, hey! just turns into Man a pops out of nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. All right, we should probably call it there. Yeah, gotta go climbing. All right, so Let's get it. To, just to reiterate, what what, what, what teacher we or what subject we would teach and what kind of teacher we'd be. But you can't I, say I know for a fact that I'm gonna be the only one that's different than the rest of you guys for what type of teacher I'd be. No, someone's gonna have a good one. So, there's always a good people are and let's let's cap it at like high school like general high school subjects yeah. mm-hmm. like what well, like science biology or i guess it was the like same bio, thing chem, <laughs> science biology or bio math entrepreneurship math, entrepreneurship math uh <laughs> c- civics and careers or the fuck it was called that's grade 10 but oh yeah but like yeah. high school but yeah g- generic Art. high school subjects i'll get it hopefully. very very last thing did you guys ever do that quiz that like that gave you your ideal profession underwater diver Gar- mine was garbage was man massage therapist i'm not even kidding mine, mine was, was actually mine was clown oh, <laughs> you did it yeah mine was literally garbage man <laughs> the worst is like i was sitting beside like one of my good friends he looks over he's like yeah that's right yeah. <laughs> what the I see it. Garbage and then I retook the whole test because it took like 30 minutes. Retook the whole thing, got the same answer. <laughs> really? It must just randomize it. it has I to. don't know. I... Well, mas- massage therapist. Rob, you right, nice... right here, buddy. Killing me. Oh, but my back. Like, killing right me. Here. Oh, they're saying something. I have something sticking out. Or no, like, oh, no, no, no. I just got a haircut. <laughs> hair. I just need a quick thumb. I'm a pretty good massager. Yeah, I need a quick... Uh... Uh, anyway, that's a quick diddle. <laughs> Need a quick uh, new room massage. And on that note. <laughs> All right. Hey, that's bye. it. See you guys. All right. Bye, lads. New room massage.